My name is Bob Desitel. I'm the uh, founder and, and chair for the neighborhood group of companies, a group of restaurants that include the Woolly Pub, Two Borealis Grills, and the Midgeta Cafe. As a company, since the early 90s, our whole focus has been raising money for river restoration, and the partnership with the Grand River became just an obvious choice for us. We got really excited about getting them involved. They quite generously offered to do some fundraising for us as part of their newly emerging River Dinner series, and they have never wavered in their commitment. In fact, they, they've said that they're gonna keep going uh, year over year to do that much more conservation work. Over the last few years, the neighborhood group as a whole has contributed what we pledged to raise, which was $75,000, and this money has been raised for the construction of the Nature Centre. The new Nature Centre project is, is going to be absolutely incredible for the community. We have about 200,000 people come to the Guelph Lake Conservation Area every year, but they don't really have a place to gather. They don't really have a place to congregate, take part in programs, and really learn about what they're experiencing. So it's a real opportunity for people who want to learn about what the park has to offer. Right now we are bursting at the seams and we really only have um, you know, one small classroom and one portable space and so we're really limited in what we can do, the number of bodies we can have here in any given day. By expanding our footprint and the size of our classrooms that's going to allow us to bring more kids out and do more programming with, with public and, and school classes as well. When you have an opportunity, just like we do in the restaurants, you know, that Nature Centre sees around 22,000 kids a year. Who better to talk about conservation of our land and our rivers and lakes than talking to the next generations? When you do a field trip at the Nature Centre, you actually go to a field. And in our case, a lake and a forest, rivers, and other natural habitats that uh, allow us to teach kids about the environments, the importance of it, the importance of our watershed, and the role that we have in maintaining a healthy ecosystem. Kids are the ones that are going to lead this charge in the future. And so that's where it really starts. It's easier when you're locked in the four walls to forget really what's happening to a lot of the lands around us. We really need to preserve special places like this. There is no planet B. And we feel if all businesses contributed even just a little bit, there could definitely be a profound difference.